Mike, you talked about the right mentality if you want a successful career in music. Please explain. A successful career in music means 200%. It's 100% great artistry. The other 100% is mentality. If a great artist does not work, it's 95% because of a mentality problem. So what I would strongly recommend you to do is do an honest introspection with yourself if anything fails in your mentality. Are you always on time? Do you always prepare the music before rehearsals, before concerts? Are you always flexible in any working environment? So maybe you have a gig and there is a bad sound system or that sound engineer or a bad piano or whatever. Do you always stay flexible or do you start arguing or being difficult? If you stop calling people because you don't want to work with them unless it's like a musical mismatch, but if it's because of they, they don't show up on time or not be prepared or, you know, they're difficult or they, whatever, it's mostly because of a mentality problem because you don't like their behavior. Did you have some of those uh, issues yourself? I've never uh, been like uh, very aggressive or have a bad temper. That's not my nature. But what I did mess up in the beginning when I was very young was like, I'm not preparing the music and look like a fool on stage or in a rehearsal room, which is very painful. I also once showed up late for a gig and they couldn't reach me. And I hadn't informed anybody that I would be late. And I arrived at the gig and there was already another pianist sitting there, you know, so it's live and learn. And already then I realized, oh, I'd better change these mindsets otherwise uh, I'm going to mess up my career you know how tragic is it that if you work for so many years to take your music to a high level you know blood sweat and tears and people stop calling you because something is not right in your behavior in your mindset in your mentality that's tragic so, so it's about personal relationships very much yes it's about how yeah, you, you know every yeah. time when I go to a gig or I hop on a plane my mindset is I want to be invited again after the concert. That's the mindset. And if you go there mm -hmm. with that kind of mindset, be flexible, be nice, deal with every situation, especially in my case, because I travel a lot to uncommon countries, exotic countries where they maybe don't have the best pianos, things like that. But I'm always flexible. I try to make the best out of the situation. And that's also something I demand from the people I play with. It's so important.